Hey Margaret, it's Andrew, uh, again working with Renee. Um, so this is our updated project. So initially we're going to have an instructions page which we plan on updating, um, but just for right now this is what we've got. Um, we can go ahead and list all our players. And then on this screen uh, we've made it so that you can um, select uh, the row and you can delete the row just like this. And yeah, and then just to show you that it actually updates the database, um, I'll go ahead and uh, close out of this and then rerun it. And then nobody's there anymore, so we can go ahead and add a player. Uh, we'll just do uh, Mr. Incredible, uh, team ID 999, position, um, center. And height, uh, he's really short, so we'll do three foot five. And it adds him right there. So, and then again, just to show you that it is actually adding him, I'll go ahead and close and rerun it. And Mr. Incredible's still there. Um, so as of right now, uh, we are able to add, delete, and list all the players. Um, and then I'll go ahead and show you the code real quick. All right, and uh, I also wanted to just quickly add for the Pebble system, um, I mentioned last time that Rene had done majority of the work. He had created majority of these classes, um, basically all of them except for the GUI. Uh, this time it was kind of my turn. Uh, that's how we kind of agreed to do this breakdown. Um, so we still believe the distribution is 50-50. Um, so the code that was written to actually create the table, um, or, yeah, to create well, not to create the table in the database, but visually on the GUI, um, that was me this time. Um, so, so far we're on track and we hope you enjoy. Thanks.